Hi guys, I guess you are wondering why I'm wearing a wet t-shirt. Well, in today's episode, I'm going to talk about uh, outgas in the film. And just for a moment, I wanted to feel like a wet piece of vinyl. And it's really not a nice feeling. Uh, so give me a moment, I will take it off and I will come back to you and we'll talk about proper outgassing. So what is outgassing? Well, basically it's a drying time of the printed graphic. And why it's so important? Well, we all know that solvent changes the performance of the film, not outgassed solvent. So it changes the tack and it changes the softness. So product becomes more tacky and we lose benefits like repositioning and product stretches uncontrolled way. But these two things are not the biggest issue that we get from not outgassed solvent print. The biggest issue about not outgassed solvent graphics is that solvent weakens the connection of adhesive and film. And it can lead to claims, which many of you for sure have seen. Deep channels can pop out leaving adhesive behind. Not many know that 90% of these claims are not related to the product or the fitter, they are related to not outgassed solvent. So if we want to talk about the outgassing, we have to consider it from two completely different standpoints. Position of outgassing and the time of outgassing. So when we talk about the position of outgassing, many of you guys do that. You take a roll, you make it loose like this, and you believe it outgasses. Some guys put it on a ventilator, palette, something, because they believe that there's some air circulation. Well, actually, you forget about a few things. First of all, solvent is more heavy than air, so it goes down. And what's most important, the layers here, they are too close to each other to have any airflow. So that kind of position is basically a waste of time. If we want to talk about the proper position of outgassing, there are actually only two options. You can lay your vinyl flat, like on the tables, but that requires a lot of space. Or we can do something like I'm having here. So basically hang your vinyl for drying, just like a wet t-shirt. Then all surface of vinyl can gas out. Of course, you need proper conditions like airflow, temperature, humidity. As warmer and as lower humidity in the room is, as quicker the product will gas out. If we talk about the time of outgassing, there are plenty of stories in the market saying you need 24 hours, 48, 72, a week. Well, to be honest, it depends because every shop is having different conditions. There's a different ventilation, there's a different temperature, different humidity. Even the ink load on prints is different. So there is no general time like 24, 48, 72. Um, actually, nobody knows what is the outgassing time, but there is a test which can show you what is the outgassing time for your shop. The test is pretty simple. You need to print a piece of vinyl, size like I'm having here is fine, and print it with the black color. That's the worst option of the ink load. Then leave it for a night on the table or in the place where you're outgassing your vinyl normally and go back to it next day. Cut away a piece of that black. Take a piece of white from the roll, like I'm having here, and go to the car. Stick the black one to the car, stick the white one next to it and compare if they are sticking the same. Check also the softness of the film. So basically stretch it without heat gun and see if it stretches the same as the white. Well, not in my case. I can clearly see the black one is far more tacky and far softer than the white one. It means I need to leave my product for one more night for outgassing. So now I'm gonna check it again after one more night. Piece of black. piece of white taken from the roll, I got it here, and let's compare it. Black one, white one, the tack level, the same, the softness, oh. basically the same, I don't see a difference. So. Outgassing for my shop is 48 hours. Outgassing is an extremely important part of preparing vinyl. And if you want to be sure that you're outgassing the proper way, hang it like me here or lay it flat 
and make a test to verify what is the outgassing time for your shop.